Hi friends, this is Ramna. Today I will show demo on how to export the SQL table data in CSV file by writing stored procedure. We know already how to export the table data by using the export wizard. So uh, uh, right click on the respective database, go to tasks and select the go to tasks and select the export data and afterwards one wizard will open sql import and export wizard will open get next and data source first you check your data source so we are getting data exporting data from sql table so for that we are selecting sql server client 11.4 so this is from which database you want even after you can select the, the database which database you require from here as well so afterwards go to next select the destination and select the, where you want to uh, load the data suppose you want to load if you want to load in csv or text file get the flat file destination or if you want to load the excel you can select as per your requirement afterwards then go to next so this is one way we we already know how to select by using the export wizard by using import and export wizard now in this case i want to show how to export the data in csv file by writing the store procedure. So here I show one table called EMP table. EMP table. It contains 17 records. So I want to export this whole data into a CSV file. For that, I already created one store procedure. If you go and select the store procedure, get employee data get employee data yeah this is the store procedure if you execute this store procedure you will get the same number of results so right now we, we have 17 rows if you execute the, this store procedure you can get the same 17 rows of records with the help by using this same store procedure i want to export the data into csv file instead of selecting the table, the employee table, all these things. Just by executing the single line uh, store procedure, uh, we can also uh, export the data in uh, flat file destination. So, how to do it, I will show in this demo. First, you right click, I have created one CSV file, which is the total uh, Total employee data is the name of this CSV file. If you go and open this file, right now we don't have any data. See here. So uh, after uh, after exporting the data, we, you, you can see 17 rows in this uh, sheet. For that, I am taking uh, right click on the sample database and go to task and select export with export data export wizard so it will open the window like this sql server important export wizard go next and select the source where you want to export so here we want to export the employee data for that you need to take sql server client 11.4 so this is uh, admin and by um, since we are opening an export wizard by right clicking on sample database it will highlight it directly or else if you want to change the database you can also change here as well so i am keeping this sample data as it is because my employee data is in this sample database go to next so here destination details you need to provide so i am taking flat file destination because i want to dump this data into csv file 
that was already already created total e, e, e employee data so i am selecting this file in which form in the in the form of uh, executing the queries here there are two options uh, copy data from one or more tables or views so if you click this one you can get the uh, table all these things uh, whatever the table and destination all this but here i want to write this write query to specify the data to transfer i am clicking the second option and click okay here i need to execute this uh, single line execute structure um, procedure query so i i just paste this query and get pass so the, this sql statement is valid click okay and go to next so here the source query is the um, source query is the query data type uh, query type the few, what is the column delimiter column delimiter i am taking as a vertical bar that is pipe symbol so my csv document will show with uh, vertical bar as a delimiter after exporting the data afterwards get next and here uh, run immediately save ssh package i am taking the run immediately as this and next so click finish to perform the following actions so these are the actions we have done so far run immediately and provide a, these, these are the actions <coughs> that we did so far and get finish so if you click the finish you get you got the even in executing the store procedure and in table as well we have only 17 records so if you go and check your csv file so earlier it is 0 kb now it is showing 1 kb right click go to edit with notepad plus plus see here you observed all 17 rows including header columns this is how you need to uh, <coughs> export the data just by writing the uh, store procedure by executing the st store procedure in the wizard thanks for watching the video thank you